Hello, I am Parij Nath. Hi, I am Kautilya Kumar Jana. We all are from Institute of Life Sciences, Bhuvneswar. In this podcast, we will give a brief overview of our recent research work that is published in Ember Reports. Our findings explain how uncontrolled activation of our body defense system against infection contributes significantly in the pathogenesis of several autoimmune disorders and how one of the GTPH family protein that is IRGM suppresses the interferon response by elevating autophagy as well as mitophagy. One of our body frontline defenders are these molecular messengers known as interferon. They provide resistance against plenty of invading pathogens like bacteria, viruses, which includes deadly SARS-CoV-2. However, uncontrolled response, particularly the type 1 interferon, result in several autoimmune disorders. So it, so, it is necessary to maintain a regulated response of type 1 interferon to avoid such conditions. A detailed comprehension of the mechanism and the regulatory molecule that suppresses the type 1 interferon can be useful and provide a technology platform for the therapeutic development against autoimmune as well as viral diseases. The main focus of our research work is to understand the crosstalk between autophagy and inflammation. We are working on a protein called IRGM. IRGM has important role in innate immunity. It belongs to the family of interferon inducible GTPs. The unique feature and interesting point of this protein is that if it is non-functional or if it is not there, it can lead to several inflammatory and autoimmune diseases. In our previous study, we have shown how IRGM protects us against inflammatory disorder. IRGM suppresses the activation of NRP3 inflammasome and prevents colitis-like condition in in vivo mice model. So before this study, the molecular by which human IRGM controls innate immune homeostasis and suppresses autoimmunity remains completely undetermined. We have demonstrated IRGM as a molecular switch that suppresses type 1 interferon response under steady state conditions. We found IRGM controls the expression of almost all major interferon stimulated genes. To control aberrant activation of interferon response, IRGM interacts with gene recognition receptors like CGAS, RIGAI, which are responsible for activating cytokine response after sensing intrinsic or extrinsic DNA or RNA. IRGM interacts and degrades these PRRs by P62 mediated selective autophagy and thereby suppresses the interferon signaling. Deficiency of IRGM results in increased expression of these PRRs, which leads to the constant activation of the IFN pathway. The question was in the absence of any external stimulus, how the sensors were in a constant activating state. What were the stimuluses? We found the cell intrinsic danger associated molecular patterns released from the dysfunctional mitochondria like double stranded DNA RNA were the major triggers. In cells, accumulation of dysfunctional mitochondria and the production of enhanced mitochondrial damps begins to stimulate the CGAS sting and the Rigai Mavs axis to drive robust activation of type 1 interferon response. IRGM helps in the clearance of the dysfunctional mitochondria, promoting mitophagy and thereby protecting the cells from the unnecessary surge of the interferon response and inflammation, which is one of the primary reasons behind autoimmune disorders. Our findings demonstrate the prominent role of IRGM in suppressing inflammation. This also explains the resurrection of IRGM in human ancestors after being dead for 20 million years and consequently highlights its importance in immune system. Our study validates IRGM as a potential target for new therapeutic against autoimmune diseases and viral diseases.